Hey, this is Lewis from Breakdance. In this video, I'm going to show you how to conditionally display elements based on the user's login status. And in this example, I'm going to display a My Account link for logged in users and a login dropdown for logged out users. So let's go into Breakdance and do it. I already am at Breakdance headers because I want to add these links to my main header. So I'll open up my header in Breakdance. And in this header, I'm using the menu builder element to create my header. So I'm just going to add another link to the menu builder element. So I'll go to add, I'll choose menu link. And this is going to be the account link. So I will just type in account and uh, then I will drag this over to the right. And to make this only appear for logged in users, I will go to settings, conditions, only show element if edit conditions, and I will add a condition. So I hit add condition, and under choose condition, I will choose user logged in status is logged in. Apply conditions. Now, an account link will display if the user is logged in. If the user is logged out, it will be hidden. Now let's add the login dropdown. So I will add a menu custom dropdown. I will call this login. And let's open up the drop down. By default, you'll see there is a heading and an image. I want to add in a login form. So I'm going to search for login form. And then I'll just drag that in. And I will delete the image. And I will delete the heading. And now we have a login form drop down. Now let's go to this menu custom drop down element and go to settings, conditions, only show element if edit conditions, add a condition, user logged in status is logged out. Supply conditions and save. And now let's go to our website and see. When we are logged in, we see the account link. And if we log out and then go back to the same page, we will see the login form. All right, that is how to conditionally display elements in Breakdance. Thank you very much for watching.